Zooming into the design to see the CAD polyline, there it is. I do so by going to alignment just to show you that the design files are empty at this stage. I then go to Alignment, Regression, Extract Alignments. You can use this function to design a single as well as a dual carriageway. You could specify to pick up the horizontal alignment from the CAD line, to pick up the vertical alignment, and that would be from the survey. You could go and specify which settings to use. At the same time, you could also go and pick up the super elevation as well as the road edges from your CAD. At the bottom, you go and specify the offsets to extract the elements from. I'm going to click on CAD Entities and go and click on that centerline. Because my road expert is turned on, Civil Designer will guide me through the design process. I just need to go and specify which parameters would be most applicable to the particular design. Here I'm extracting every 20 meters on straights and every 10 meters on curves. I'm going to extract cross sections 20 meters to the left and the right of the center line. Specify which surface you're working with. So this would be the existing ground and then specify on which road layer you would like to extract the ground level onto. These are the 128 different road layers I mentioned earlier. Now it's going to go through the design process. It's looking at the horizontal as well as the vertical alignment. It's asking me if I'd like to pick up the pivot lines from my CAD entities. I'm going to say no. It's looking at the vertical alignment. Where would I like the results? Screen output. Click on OK. So it's completing the design, it's generating my edge levels. And that would then be the road design. If I go back to alignment and I go and select horizontal edit alignment, there you can see it's picked up my PI points from the CAD line. 